AITA for not buying my sister what was on her registry. I-29F have a sister 26F. She's pregnant and recently had a baby shower. She had a registry of things she needed. I didn't buy anything off of that though. I had ordered custom-made onesies with my niece's name on it. And a changing pad. I don't have much money. I have a geriatric dog who cost a lot. I thought the gift I gave was cute and meaningful. And that she'd also be getting a lot of other gifts. After the baby shower my sister pulled me aside and asked why I didn't pick nothing out off her. Registry. I had said I saw those and thought they were cute and the registry is just a suggestion. My sister got annoyed and said the registry is stuff they actually need and that I gave her useless things. Then walked away. I guess she talked to my mom because my mom also said to me I should have just picked something from there because I know how my sister is and it would have helped her out. I'm now upset because I was excited about my gift and wasn't aware that the registry was so important. NTA. Registry is just a suggestion. Gifts are supposed to be given freely and accepted graciously. She's acting entitled. Just had a baby shower. Majority of people didn't buy off the registry which was frustrating because we put a lot of time into choosing those items and it was all stuff we really needed. Instead, we now have 100 plus sets of onesies sized 03 we'll never have enough time to wear duplicates of things we already had. And not one gift came with a gift receipt. With that said, I would never dream of saying anything to anyone about their choice to gift us the things that they did. We are extremely grateful that everyone loved us enough to even attend let alone want to gift us anything to begin with. Extremely ungrateful and rude of your sister. The only appropriate response to a gift is, thank you. NTA. Info. Was there anything on the registry within your budget? NTA. Having had some babies myself. I think your gift probably isn't going to be that useful given how quickly babies go through sizes. But a registry is not an obligation. I don't think anyone is ta here. You tried to give a thoughtful gift. However, registries are there for a reason. It's what they most need and want for the baby. If I want to ensure they like what I get or use it, I go off registry. If it's all items I can't afford alone or that's what left. I get a gift card towards those items people forget about the practical items. Info. Was there anything you could afford on the registry? All this onesie love. I must be the only person who hated them and didn't use them. Honestly without knowing what was on the registry it is impossible to make a judgment. When I have gone to baby showers the registry has included things like cloth diapers, pacifiers or bottles, diaper bags or even a few more expensive things like monitors. For one friend a few of us got together and bought a pump. I do not know a single person who has needed clothes that will last for 23 months. Most can get those free and when I have been to baby showers the aim is to get something needed. But again, I do not know what your sister needed or what your relationship is like. We have a bunch of kids. I only had one baby shower with number one. Honestly did I get stuff I didn't love? Sure. Did I thank every single person who came for their time and gift? Absolutely. If you want to pick out every single thing your baby has don't have a shower and buy it all yourself. NTA. NTA. Your mom's comment, you know how she is says it all. NTA. You gave a thoughtful gift. The registry is a wish list, Gil. Sister is all. NTA. Your sister sounds like an entitled brat. You can come to my baby shower with your gift since your sister wants to be so rude and ungrateful. I'll happily accept it. 
as I taught my child when she received a gift she neither liked or wanted. Smile and say thank you. Do whatever you want with received gifts. Except criticize. Op NTA. NTA. A gift is a gift. You don't owe your sister anything. If she needs something specific, then she can go out there and get it herself. Though a onesie is something she should be thankful for. NTA having two babies myself my mom got me custom onesies for both boys. My oldest passed and I hold on to his custom onesies every night. And my youngest I have both of his custom onesies to keep. NTA. But your sister could use a refresher in good manners. I would gave been so touched by such a thoughtful gift. NTA your gift was very thoughtful and meaningful. It shouldn't matter if it wasn't on the registry or not. NTA if she doesn't want to take it all back. Don't even want to bother explaining why you aren't the ass. Baby showers always cause drama and can kiss my rear. NTA. And for every gift giving event from now until eternity. Buy her a $5 subway card. Same for your mom. Gifts are the option of the giver. Not the person receiving them. You ordered something custom made. FFS. What is her problem? I think your gift was heartfelt and special. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.